Okay, so I'm going to apply my video is upside down, but I'm going to apply this into my cavity. Mm -hmm. In there, in between these two, I have a hole. Like that. Right in there. So it's just to wash your teeth with warm water to rinse it. And then it says to grab this and take a piece out. It says with your finger, make it into a ball. I guess like a long ball. Like a long way, not circle. And then I need to find out where the hole was at. It also says to bite on it. It doesn't taste like nothing, so it's not really something that's going to taste nasty. Mm -hmm. I am so terrible at this. I'm just doing what it says. So, take another piece right here, and I'm going to cut it into another ball mm -mm. I hurt because I pushed it in huh? ah. mm. okay I pushed it too deep in In case if it did hurt, I came with back up. I got this oral pain reliever. Take the Amazon. So I guess before it gets hard or something. Now that tastes nasty. Now my tongue is numbed. It has it says wash cavity area with warm water and do not dry. My lips is getting numbed. With spade tool or pinch a small amount tempting max to the viral and roll into ball between fingers. Slightly overfill the cavity with tempering max and pack into place with Applicator tool lit tip. Close your teeth together as if you were bidding down on a piece of paper and gently chew or grind on the place, filling a couple times to place a formable bite. Use a moist cotton swab to remove excess tempering max. 
from around the area moisture with accelerated the set tempering wax will set softly in your mouth within a few minutes but avoid chewing on the repair for two to three hours and allow the material to fully set so i need like not this one hold on i'm using the wrong one okay I figure out oh, because that's not a part of it. And then it says, um, so I gotta keep applying to it, I guess. First time. I don't want to go to the dentist, like, because it is not something that is in my budget at the time to get my tooth fixed. So I have to use this method. I know it's crazy and something I want to do, but as you can see, look, my lips sleep, so I can't do much. I'm applying it softly because it hurt. Most of it out. It hurts a little. But like I numbed it. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it fell it in. It says you're supposed to like bite on a cotton swab or something with warm water, like remove it with it, whatever the excess of it, but. Um, well, again, this is what I use. Let me put it upside down because my camera is upside down. Maybe you guys can see it. And this is what I use. 
you know, it's a backwards right here. It looks better. So it doesn't taste bad. Let me fix my phone. Um, it doesn't taste bad at all. Like I feel like it hurts a little, but because I haven't numbed, it doesn't hurt that much. And the more I press it down, the more it hurts me. But I need to numb it just a little more because look who I'm gonna look. And then it got um. Mm. My lips can be numbed again now. Now this thing, which is what I'm using, I bought it both of them at the dollar store. So it's Rexol Oral Pain Relief, and and it is anesthetic. So it feels like it's getting hard. Um, why you got, why you, why you trying to eat my seed? She got, I got this little seed. Hmm. You, why you trying to eat my seed so bad? Hmm. Hmm. Let me see if I can put it closer. Mm-hmm. So, oh my god, my lips are numb to here. All this is numb. Mm hmm. Look. So that's how it looks so far. So we'll see. My nose is so numbed. Maybe the pain will go away. I've been like this for about a month and so with pain. So I can't eat meats. I can't eat anything at all with this sign. So I'm hoping with this I can actually chew on my food without having to feel pain. Because food is, doesn't go in there. So what I did before um, putting any of this in again. Was I went to the bathroom. First of all I used one of these little. Where is it? These little things. They sound right now. It has some of that gooey thing. That the putty it has. Because I was cleaning with it. But I used this first to clean my teeth inside. Make sure that there was no dirt in there um after that i went to the bathroom and i washed my mouth with warm water like it's not some of the thing so i used a toothpaste and a scrub real good and i washed it with warm water because if you wash it with cold water it hurts anyway so we can't use cold water at all so i washed it with warm water 
and I scrubbed it real good again make sure that there was nothing in there then I came here to do this video where you guys saw all the steps that I did which this is the thing that comes with this Let's see and as you can see I didn't use much of it because it was only one molar so this is what is left in there see so oh my lips are all numbed they're numbed from here to here and then so these were the tools I bought me you know to make this happen so I got me these little toothpicks to so I can scrub and clean very well my teeth you know then I got me the these and then obviously you need the backup plan because if you're in pain while you're doing this it's horrible so that's why I got me this one everything I bought was at the dollar store at the family dollar for a dollar 25 I mean dollar tree my bad dollar tree for a dollar 25 everything each item so um now i guess i'll have to figure out what would happen and i guess i'll find out tomorrow and see what would happen and if it will continue to hurt if i'm gonna need a real dentist to work on my teeth i hope not because if not i'm gonna have to spend money from my pocket and so far i don't want to do that so and that's what i did today so next time maybe i'll show you how i did my diy look i did this in my room hold on let me see if i can make it you guys can see it sorry that that's in my room look that's my ceiling actually so i did all that put a like a curtain there in my roof and then I put another two curtains and then my lamp it's like that so I did it like that that's what I did so and then I, that's my wall that's for my cat so my cat will jump all the way from here she'll jump into my bed and then I did all this stuff and then here and then she would jump from here to here to here. Her food is up there. Everything that belongs to her is up there on that little um, cave. So that's all I'm going to show you for now. Because today was all about this. And we'll see what happens. So God bless you all. And I got to pray so I can get some sleep so I can go to work tomorrow. Hopefully, if I'm in now.